was able to turn the corner off of a similar play. That time, Richard Jackson, patient, got his man on his hip, able to hit that runner in the lane. Johnson, clever footwork and a deft touch. 19. Murray tries to play a two-man game with Furl, calls his own number, and rightfully so. Feels the defense and exactly where they are. And he's open more times than he realizes, but I would say Luke Kennard is getting an A to an A+. plus. Maintaining excellent spacing, and speech, speaking of which, that play. But right now, it's a little quiet, hence you see the lack of help a lot of times, and that time, Murray. Murray. Nice pass inside to Pirtle. Great catch, counted, and a foul. Clipper is down by 10. Sell for three, straight but strong. Long rebound goes back out to Murray. Eases into the trip. Paul George gave it up to Man. Man did the right thing. Drove baseline, gave it up to RJ. Now they're going to make it, but guess who? showing off some fancy footwork to get back in and get that block. Hurdle, the floater, is good. Now on the perimeter, can get around him. The rim is open. Acrobatic shot as he reorganizes in mid-flight, but misses. Murray in the corner to an open McDermott. White in transition. Nice move, high off the window. Good second effort, not there. Clippers shooting just 38% from the field. I thought Bledsoe was going to reverse that. He's been able to transform the way he coaches, the style that he coaches. We said at the start of the show, the NBA is a better place with him in the league. <laughs> How do you know? You, know? you remember? Yeah. How old were you? Eight. Murray out of the timeout, mid-range, no, long shots, long rebounds, goes back to McDermott, into the paint, reverse layup is good. You're almost daring them to do, but they found the range early to help build the lead. DeJounte Murray continues to impress. Now you pick another steal, because you set the tone.